um, I mean, my participation as an example it was facilitated by the UNDP. Uh, uh, a lot of us actually they recognized the, the expert role we play, and, and they invited us, uh, and they've given us the voice to contribute to uh, the development. I also know that they are partly funding uh, the conference. I also know that the German government, the, the Netherlands. And several other European partners are also participating in it. So um, even though I, I agree totally that this must be homegrown, it must be led by us. We must take charge and control. And by that I mean the Northwest. I, I am from the Northwest, so I, I, I speak we uh, as Northwest. We must take charge. But our development partners have a lot of technical expertise. Um, they've learned from their mistakes in the north in the northeast. Don't forget that the situation in the Northwest has been ongoing for more than a decade. They've been involved. They facilitated uh, the development of the security and peace building framework that we have in the Northeast. So the mistakes that were made there, uh, and already I think discussion is going on in that regard to ensure that there is an avoidance of the repetition of some of the mistakes that were learned in, in, the, in, the North, in the Northeast. But at the end of the day, the technical expertise that they have and their ability to also identify without any um, interest uh, stakeholders that can contribute in a meaningful manner to the discussions, um, I think is something that needs to be commended. But I would like to emphasize that we should never allow an outsider to take charge. We should take charge. Um, that's, I think, what the Northwest Governors Forum is also doing. But um, at the end of the day, I would like to see, again, and I don't want this to be lost, at, that a framework must be developed at the end of this conference. And that framework should have clear implementation guidelines with key performance indicators for each of the challenges that have been identified so that you as the media, what estate of the real, and then organizations like mine would now monitor the development and remind both the UN and the governors repeatedly that this is a commitment you made. You spent money in organizing this conference, you made a commitment, and these are the timelines that you provided. Where are we in terms of the implementation of that timeline? Thank you very much.